Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a finale and this is the Partners in Cream project pan that I'm ending. This is a project created by Steph and Delin and they invited me and I'm really really grateful for it because it has been so much fun to work on my cream products. I really love the idea of this project and I'm definitely going to keep on working on my cream products even though I'm not doing this project anymore. This project is just not very motivating for me anymore so I think it is a good time time to end it. My products are just hard to make progress on. I do have one empty though for this update which is pretty exciting but it took me seven months to finish and the rest of the product took me seven months to make this kind of progress so I just thought I'm not going to finish it this year uh, and not even with a baby in October. So let me show you the empty and my progress for the products. So my empty comes from my BS Cosmetics Shein XO palette and this is an eye palette if you don't know and the lip side of this as well which I am working on. If you know I have a pan on every single lip product in this palette and I have been working on three lip products overall in the project from, the, from this palette. The really dark one and the really light one has been in for, since the beginning. A few months ago I switched out the dark one for a curl. And I will show you guys where I am and where I was last time with my palette. I'm pretty excited about it. Don't know how to hold it. Look at it! I'm so excited. I finished the light shade today. I'm so excited. There was so little left and I knew I was going to film this video so I used it as a blush and on my lips. I have been using it so much for the last month because I really wanted to have it done by this filming session, you know, finale. And because I was just a little bit tired of it being so nude, I actually mixed in a little bit of the curl into the last mix. So that is what I have on my cheeks and my lips right now. Use the last bit to reapply on my lips today. Right now, before I set down filming, it is so exciting. So I do have some progress on the curl one as well. Not as much, but a little bit. I have expanded the slightest bit. So that is really exciting. To end on a high note for this um, lipstick palette. I do have a plan on using these as cream blushes as well as lipsticks. But for right now, I'm just going to use them as cream blush until I put something in a project. And that will most likely be next year. So because it's the beginning of August, I thought I would play around with some brighter cream blush blushes. And I thought this was the perfect palette. I don't have any more cream blush in my collection, so I really want to do the lipstick as a blush method and today when i used the last bit of the lipstick as a cream blush it actually worked really nice so i thought it was a perfect opportunity to use this as cream blush and as lipsticks but it took me forever to just use it on my lips so i thought multitasking is the way forward to get this out of my collection fast so faster okay let me switch product and not talk as much this one I'm pretty excited about. I actually hit my goal for this month. Um, this is the Strobe Struck Cream Highlighter from W7, as you may know. And this is where I was last time and this is where I am now. So as you can see, I have definitely hit my goal from last update, which was to officially be halfway done with this product. I'm really stoked about it and for the last few days I have been wearing little less clothing on top so i could use it here on my collarbones and on my shoulders so that really helped <laughs> hitting my goal for this update um i'm really excited to be ending on a high note for this one as well um like being halfway through the product i will definitely keep it in front of me on my makeup table but it's not going to be something that i reach for a lot only here in the summertime i think um, so let's see. I haven't used it a lot a lot this month because I have been really into just using a concealer instead of foundation because I finished the foundation. And therefore this is just a little bit too dark when I don't have any foundation on top or something like that because it's... I'm, I'm pale. So this is where I am with the highlighter at this point and I'm really excited about it. To be quite honest. The closure is really not uh, that great anymore so... 
you can definitely tell that I have been using it. Then we have the last product because I'm only working on four. This is the L'Oreal Gel Eyeliner in Pure Black. I do think you can see some progress on this, but I don't know how much exactly. But I am working on this part down here, so maybe you can see it is slightly smaller, the product itself. There's not a lot left. I was really hoping that I could finish it this year, but I have my doubts. I really do, but I have been really loving using this gel eyeliner if I'm just careful not to make it too thick because I have hooded eyes and it transfers onto my eyelid, which sucks. <laughs> and that also means that I can use more glitter in my crease because that will cover it. So that's why if you have seen a lot of glitter in my crease, it is because of this one because it transfers. I'm pretty excited about where this is ending as well. I think I have done really well uh, for this gel eyeliner. And I'll just keep using it as I am now. So hopefully I can have it done even though I'm not doing the project. That is the status of the project and where I am ending. I'm really excited about my progress overall in this project. I'm really excited to have a lipstick done. I didn't see that coming to be quite honest. But I did know that the chances for the light one to be done was higher than the other was because it was nude but yeah i have been reapplying a lot when i get home and that is basically how i have used it up but seven months is a long time to use a product i hope you guys have enjoyed this series from my side at least you can watch the entire playlist of everyone's videos down below there's so many videos you have days or weeks to binge watch this project if you want to like there's more than 70 people doing this project so my videos will not be there anymore which is a little bit sad and bittersweet but i'm fine i will come strong next year i promise i just need a break over the fall because i have a new baby i have a baby by then and she is kicking right now as we speak. So, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. And until my next video, please take care. I hope you will stick around. Even though I'm not doing this project anymore. And have a good one. Until I will see you next time. Or again. I can't talk. Let's just cut it here. Bye guys.